I have to say my piece about this whole like these this idiotic duo. By the way, I find it really ironic that they have the nerve to call me Funkle Baby when just judging by how stupid they act and are <laughs> and have been lately, it's you're the one with the inbreeding in your family tree somewhere down the line. There's this like reaction channel. A lot of you might not know who they are, but a lot of you probably do. Here's now like this person has like climbed a social status rank. Like they've increased their income greatly and feed their kids and everything else. And you know, buy all kinds of expensive crap off of using my content, right? They like, they like do like the worst bullying. They, all they do is like fat shame, make fun of di di my diabetes, um, whatever. And they're, sh this person is like 300 pounds himself. Okay, so that's hypocrisy number one. So they got a terms of service strike. Like I strike them all the time here and there. Like whenever I have a free moment, I strike them for bullying and harassment because that's what they do and they deserve it. I don't care if you, you shouldn't strike people and eh, they make you money. No, they use all my content. They take money from me and they're freaking assholes and I'm going to strike them. Cry about it all you want. I don't care. Fatty podcast. What is it with all these like reactors who don't even have the balls to show their face and are all also 300 pounds themselves making fun of other overweight women. I'll never get that. Anyway, so they got a strike for terms of service and they like went, they just like went ham. Like they, they freaked out. They can't take any criticism. Anyone who used their content, they would false copyright strike them. So people like the Gaining Ground, Hillbilly Belinda, like just anyone who's used, like Yo Mama, anyone who's used their content, okay? They they strike them for false copyright strike. Now these idiots have an idiot lawyer. Like, I don't know if you watch The Simpsons, but she reminds me of Lionel Hutz. <laughs> Thought, okay, we're gonna copyright strike these people and make it look legit. No, YouTube eventually caught on to it, right? And um, they're like, you know, you can't do anymore. Like, we're, we're, we feel like you're abusing the system, which they are. And what really gets me why I'm bringing this up is because these people have the nerve to strike other creators for using their content when these idiots have an entire channel for years using my content. They decided to uh, react to their videos. What are they going to do? Like copyright strike me for using their content, which is my content? Like I, I can't get over the stupidity of it. Like. Anyway, if you're watching, and I know you are, because you watch every single thing I do, every breath I take, every fart I do, every every little friggin' can go, you're pathetic for striking people, abusing the copyright system. You wanna talk shit about me? Cam up, it's easy. They're crides, they're like a disease on the internet. Like, that's all they are. How are you gonna copyright strike other people for using your content here and there, which by the way, it's fair use, when all you do, all you do, is use my content every single day. I'm not gonna, people are like, you should copyright strike her. No, cause I'm not an idiot like her, you know why? Because if you copyright strike somebody, I learned this a long time ago, you can't just copyright strike somebody. Like you have to take them to court. They're, YouTube is not a mediator in this instance. You have to take the person to court. You have to follow up with your own lawyer. If you think I'm wasting my time, like no, like honestly, what's gonna happen to them? What's gonna happen to them is they're gonna take this to court because they're suing people. I can't, it's so embarrassing. I can't, they're taking people to court. They're suing them for copyright infringement. They're going to have to pay those legal fees because if you abuse that system, if you make false copyright claims, you're gonna have to go, hi, green grapes. You're gonna have to pay people's legal fees. That's all you're gonna do. You're gonna waste your time. You're gonna waste your money. Their own weight loss journey, they're, the two of them together are over 500 pounds. Like, are you kidding me? Get out of here boggles my mind. Hi Gabba is crying for false copyright strike while her whole channel stealing Foodie Beauty's content with no creativity but crap like her. Exactly, she sits there and is like, you're gonna lose a foot, Chantel. By the way, I know you can't speak proper English, it's Chantal, okay? Yeah, I'm like the center of this shit gore world community that you've created and I don't have a right to say anything? I don't think so, buddy. Here are people unsub Vera. My subs are fine. I have my plaque, good, I'm done. I don't care how many people unsub now. I don't. You can't unsub to somebody and be like, I'm gonna, I'm not gonna sub to you anymore unless you do this. I don't care, goodbye. You don't know me well. You don't know me well. And by the way, I'm on a good track right now. My sugars are coming down. I'm back on my meds. I'm down 15 kgs. Thank you very much. This shirt is fitting me now. I don't know what else you want, Vera, but I don't owe you anything. Yeah, Lois, I've been checking twice a day. If it's gone down, like even if it's not accurate, I still have to figure the machine out. At least it was 24 yesterday. Was it yesterday that I went to the doctor? 24. Now it's down to like 15.5. So it's coming down like, you know, alhamdulillah. So the medication makes more of a difference than I even realized. I honestly don't know what I was thinking when I wasn't taking it. I was just being so like 
self-negligent and stupid. Like, I don't, I, that, there's no other word for it. I think that's really high in fiber first, like um, your vegetables and then your protein and then your carb. If you eat them in that order, it's supposed to slow down. And that's the idea of the unicity. It's like a fiber drink, right? Made of oat fiber. So it fills your stomach up with fiber. I wake up depressed sometimes when I think like, I, like it hits me when I wake up like, oh, you have to eat healthy. <laughs> um, what? <laughs> like for real, because the head, the head, it's still in my head, you know? Diet gravy. Uh, honestly, I don't, I can't believe I'm going to say this. The thought of drinking, like the thought of gravy grosses me out right now. Bitch, shut up. Ew. Cam up, Yaba. Cam up. All of them, they're all cowards. Cam up, care. I, I'm not like them. I don't care what people look like. I don't give a shit. What matters is your... Who you are as a person, you know? Every single person, no matter how good you are, no one's a saint. People make mistakes. I draw some reaction channels being more hateful and vile than they claim you are. All of them are. <laughs> Most of them. Like, who am I? I'm hateful and vile? Like, wh wh why am I hateful and vile? If I ever rage, it's against people who are like, come for me first. Other than that, I'm a very nice person. Actually, a Whopper sounds so good right now. <laughs>